So the first day we had gone out and we kept trying to stay after those birds, but it just ended up not working out. I mean, we saw them at that one point, but you know, we just, we couldn't catch up to them, couldn't get them to gobble. And um, I tried to put together a plan for the next day. Mike was gonna go with William and then I ended up going to a different spot. This was on their property down the road. We just decided we would try and split up and go to some different areas and uh, see what we could find. So. Eat my bar 
and um, just see if I heard anything else. Something just flew up as soon as I turned the camera over to me. So, man, I don't know. I don't know what that was. I never even saw it until it got up above the tree limbs here. I knew that was going to happen. That's part of why I pulled this out, but... I didn't figure they'd come from behind me. <laughs> and, of course, it could have been a crow, but I'm trying sitting here for a second and then maybe get up and move that way because one thing about it I mean they're on a big river here so I'm sure they could fly across it but I don't know that they would want to so it does give you a little bit of an advantage if, if you go that way so sit there for half an hour an hour just yeah. hammering down really yep yeah i mean he just kept on he got in that little pocket on the right hand side of it mm -hmm. so he couldn't see at all yeah i knew he was in within 100 yards yeah He will be behind yeah. somewhere. He, yeah. he, he, he will be coming eventually. Uh huh. I think the first auto sponsor me now. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I'll tell you what, that is exciting. Right and then I look over and he don't have his gun out. Yeah. <laughs> it was just propped up. Uh -huh. and, like, and I'm like, man, I should have told him to have his gun about ready. Yeah. <laughs> He let the thing get within about 15 yards. Yeah. <laughs> 20 maybe. <laughs> and then uh, he starts moving and the, the turkey goes, bop, bop, bop. Yeah. And he's like, oh, <laughs> you know, you can tell he had that expression <laughs> on his face already. And yeah. Boom. Get out of there. That was just cool. That's awesome. It's wild, man. Yeah. That's your first one, huh? First one ever. Man. They say once it once it gets in you, you can't yeah. get it out. Uh, that, that feeling, I mean, <laughs> I feel like the turkey saw my chest beating. Like, yeah. Just like, yeah. Boom, boom, boom. Uh -huh. you said, you know, sitting there congratulating and all that. Yeah. I, I think you saw my, my chest beating. Uh -huh. <laughs> my heart beating. God. Did you see anything else? No. I mean, I thought I heard one gobble. I mean, it was just every now and then I'd, I'd feel like I heard a gobble and it just, you know, 
I couldn't tell what direction it was. I had something come right beside me. That I had, I don't know, like five different crows flying around the field. Oh, yeah. And I'm hoping that's all it was. But it's, I mean, it wings sounded bigger to me. But what? it was like, I didn't see it until it was already flying up. So this morning, I thought I saw two turkeys in the field as crows. Mm -hmm. I had to wait till they flew off to see what they were. Yeah. Um, and then probably around 7.30, Mm -hmm. had four hens fly down off the roost and watched them fly down into the field and just lost them in the fog. Yeah. Never saw them again. Mm -hmm. Ever. So, I mean, I don't really know what happened. Yeah. But he started calling, like, early on. But it was real far away. Mm -hmm. Like, you could tell, like, hey, the, what you were probably hearing, we couldn't hear. Yeah. That's what, That was the weird right. part. So, when you said, y'all got one over by you. We didn't hear that. Yeah. Now, he followed a hen that way and eventually started moving that way. Yeah. Mike would call. He'd respond to the call, but mm -hmm. you could tell he definitely wouldn't come to the call because yeah. he was slow to come. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, every bit of 45 minutes is what he was hammering down yeah. on that one hen following mm -hmm. um, It was absolutely wild. Yeah. And that hen comes by and Mike says, he's going to be right behind me. Uh -huh. And so I... I see that hen and I freeze. Yeah. And I have frozen for what seems like an eternity. Mm -hmm. And finally that gobbler comes around the corner and you know, heart just mm -hmm. the adrenaline rush. I mean I yeah. don't get the adrenaline like rush deer hunting anymore. Yeah. Not like that unless it's uh -huh. a monster bug. Right. I mean, it's you know, I'm just shaking over yeah. there and <laughs> and like I said, I knew I needed to get my gun up. But I knew at this point in time where he showed up. Yeah. There was not a chance. He comes through. And he gets to a point where he's like, "Hack at you." Not being an easy shot because I'm right-handed. Pushing the left is easy. Pushing the right is mm -hmm. not easy. Yeah. Okay. Well, he's not there. Comes to the second point and shoot him. Figure he starts seeing something like us. Mm -hmm. Okay. Getting a little nervous here. If I've got to push over, I can. Yeah. Just let him kept coming. He came right where I wanted him. And he's definitely spotted us when I started to pull the gun up. Yeah. Safety off. And he started, he turned around to walk away. And wow. Mm -hmm. Gosh. I mean, just the shaking. Yeah. Is uncontrollable. That's awesome. So, it's something else, man. Yeah. Something else. You might just got a little brim or a bass. <laughs> That didn't take you long. That works. Damn thing's full of those things about that size. Well, yeah. yeah. That's a good looking fish though. Full of them, I mean. Put him back. I don't, I don't need them. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I'm telling you, the uh, I thought the turkey could see my heart pumping out of my chest. That's how wild it is. <laughs> Oh, it's extremely different from deer mm -hmm. hunting because they're talking the whole time. So deer just, you know, pops out of the woods and, you know, I think I've seen a deer grunt or snort and wheeze like twice. Where this turkey called for 30, 40 minutes before we even got to see him. Yeah. 